day, another dollar, baby. Hey, I don't know what a, I don't know about a dollar. Fat boy quit his job at the freaking strip club, so. <laughs> What's cracking, fat boy? You get paid for this? <clears throat> Barely. Oh, okay. Uh, we get about a couple cents from mom when she watches. <laughs> oh, no, thank God for mom. <laughs> oh, what's cracking, y'all? All right, we just, uh, yesterday we were saying we were probably going to do back day uh, today because we're kind of trying to switch it up a little bit. But uh, our backs are pretty sore. Legs are freaking sore as hell, man. We've been sore every day. We've been at it for almost a month, hardcore. And we're still getting sore every day, which is a good thing. It means we're working hard. Yeah. Uh, my recovery, my sleep hasn't been the greatest, you know? I've got... Uh, two well one baby but a toddler and so it hasn't been the greatest uh how's your sleep been pretty good yours been good yeah well good for you it is. Uh, <laughs> and uh but we, I, I have a dog so you know some nights are rough depends <laughs> if it storms or not so i feel you i feel your pain yeah yeah, yeah. well luckily you don't have to worry about storms too much now that the fall is here yeah i was i was it was so beautiful this morning when i woke up about seven o'clock it was so nice and chilly it was cold and now it's like 80 something degrees <laughs> I'm like, God, man, come on, I want the fall weather. But we decided today we're gonna do chest and tries instead. Probably gonna start with a lot of dumbbell work. We've been doing a lot of barbell work lately. And uh, so today we are going to, I think, work on a lot of dumbbell work. That was Fat Boy's idea. Yeah. And um, you know, it only goes up to the 50s. Uh, we can do pretty high reps with the 50s. So uh, I think I'll be doing that today, but we're gonna do a couple warm up sets, get right into it, starting with incline dumbbell press ha 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 i say can you hit that for me and he just punches the camera like he's some kind of freaking comedian over here yeah, I oh. what angle am i at here 30 30 okay. we've got the 35s warm up man I'm warm. Also, Fat Boy did cardio before our workout today. So I think we're gonna go ahead and pull out the 50s. You want the 50s too? Yeah, give them a shot, see what we can do. Cool. We'll do the 50s and see what we can do, y'all. We're contemplating getting uh, uh, 50 to 100 pound dumbbells set because uh, it's just kind of nice, you know? You can get up one of this and one of that and one of this, but it's like, it's something that you just, you want to have every once in a while. You're like, oh, I want the 55s. Oh, now I want this. And this is going to be easier for me, especially when you're growing or whatever. That might be coming down the pipeline. We've been talking a lot about equipment today because, well, Rep called me and said that our cables will not be in until 2025. So they freaking had some type of manufacturing issue and all this other BS. And so they called me yesterday and told me that. So now for this entire road to 100 or road to 200 series for uh, by the end of the year, we will not have the cable. So I apologize, folks. But uh, it's a brand new system and I don't think anybody has them yet, really. Yeah. <sighs> But they did give us a, they got us a gift card. Whoop. Yay. Hey, I'm trying to talk here. And, talk to uh, the microphone. <laughs> yeah, the microphone. <laughs> hey guys. Oh shit, my crap. Yeah, they did give us a, a gift card for the website. I guess that makes it a little better. But uh, we're gonna order a couple more things for the rack. So we can have them and then hopefully uh, make it through the year, I guess. You smell like egg salad. Did you eat an egg salad? No, but I had our bowl of eggs. Ah. Nice. Okay. Set number two here. Set number three. Oh, I'm still at Fat Boy's length. We'll try this out though. That's all right. Got 
20 again somehow. Let's be set number five. All right, folks, we're gonna be doing decline skull crushers. It sounded good. So we're gonna have to hand each other the bar here, but oh, we don't have anything to hold our arms onto, but I'm gonna go in here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to try to grip the bench a little bit. Oh, Give me that ass. This is with 60. Oh yeah, this feels good. Oh. I mean, whether you're doing decline or not, you still kind of get the same range of motion. Oh shit. Oh damn. That skull crusher burn, baby. Is that it? Was that the last round? <laughs> oh, got the walking farts. Sorry, wasn't recording. 286. Yep. Sadly, that was round number 10. <laughs> you just like, get the last one. And yeah. you're like, I'm done. I'm, uh, I don't know. I might try uh, freaking uh, dumbbell flies at this angle. Get a real good stretch on there. I'm going to try that real quick. See how that goes. Actually, I'm going to just go right into it. Maybe use the 20s, maybe? Me and decline, it's definitely kind of hard to hold yourself. Ugh. Stable. Oh. Good stretch. You know, this ain't heavy enough. I was gonna yeah. say mid 25s. The 30s, but I was thinking for you. Yeah, probably 30s. So, anyways, I'm just kidding. <laughs> You guys seen my truck over here, by the way? Sorry, fat boy, I'm gonna cut you off for a second. You know, it's just one thing after another with this thing. You can see. I decided yesterday that I was just gonna, you know, pull all of the wiring out and start rewiring the entire truck before I even have a wiring kit. <laughs> I have been having issues with my starter clicking. I put a new starter in, I put a new battery in. Everything's good. The starter solenoid is completely fine. Got it tested. Put the multimeter on it. Got a short somewhere in the line. Started taking some of the wires apart and all of them were falling apart. They're like the original wiring from the 80s. I'm like, you know what? What a better time than now. Should have done it whenever we did the engine years ago, but got to do it. So I'm going to order a little like painless performance kit or something and probably rewire that baby up. At least the fuse box go into the starter and maybe a couple other things. I don't think I need to do like, you know, the headlights or anything. All that stuff, the conduit is still good and the wires underneath look great. So there's a lot to do. I've got a giant checklist on that thing. And I'm like, I just keep ripping one thing apart at a time, but it runs and drives, so that's good. I mean, not without the wires in it, but you know what I mean. <laughs> oh shit. Some eggs coming up. Eggs do something nasty to Fat Boy. This subject, when we were freaking kids, Fat Boy's like, the funniest nights of my life were being around him and he would bring over a pickled egg. He would pickle his own eggs. And he'd bring it over. He's like, dude, if you want to hear me fart. Because I thought his fart was, farts were funny. And so he's like, dude, do you want to hear me fart like crazy? And I was like, yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. And so he goes home and he gets a pickled egg and he brings it over and he eats the pickled egg. 30 minutes later, he's farting like ungodly amount. Like... 
ungodly sounds are coming out of his ass. And it, it was just us and our other buddies just dying laughing for hours on end. That's how we became friends. That's how we became best friends right there. <laughs> what do you want to do for tries? Maybe we'll do our little, I don't know. I wish we had a freaking cables. Uh, Take it easy on the tries so they're not completely fried the rest of the week. Yeah, whatever you want to do. Let's do some overhead press and then end it with that. Do a pump check. Yeah. We're gonna do seated. Okay. Oh, frick. That is hard, dude. Beautiful. <laughs> 19. Oh. Or it might have been 20. Oh, I think we're doing that for Oh, you're such a good chair. <laughs> oh. Don't make love to my chair. That's weird. Sloppy seconds. Yeah, baby! How are you feeling? Tired, sore, and miserable. And we ain't doing that kind of pump check. <laughs> All right, folks. Oh, man, triceps are freaking pumped today. Oh, chest, feeling good. Definitely feeling thicker. Eating like a freaking monster, folks. I'm not having really issues no more after the lactose deal. Like, after cutting the whey out and switching to an isolate, well, tomorrow's back day for sure. I think we're gonna skip deadlifts this week and we're gonna probably use the Viking press and do some freaking, you know, pooling, whatever shit, rows. Yeah, we'll do pulls. some, maybe some rack pulls. I'm gonna try to get some more pull-ups. Oh, feeling good, feeling big. Last night I weighed in at almost 190. I know that's at night, but I couldn't believe it. I was like, I've never been 190, dude. I can't wait to see it on the scale, maybe tonight. I, uh, today I tried something a little new before I came out here, don't tell. Don't tell Joey, but I did a little orange juice to get those extra carbs in. Just a little bit, just like, you know, five ounces, like a little five ounce cup. I just down that right before I came out here, get a couple extra carbs and my pump feels absolutely amazing. Obviously with all the oatmeal, two cups of oatmeal, all the milk with it, it's, it's a lot. Catching up to you, fat boy. Yeah. You're trapped. Shoulders feeling good. My triceps are so tight. Holy crap. Look how freaking far that thing's sticking out. God dang. I'm so conceited because I never look at fat boy and pump checks. I just look at myself. Do you ever look at me? Nope. <coughs> Which one do you guys look at more? That's right. Give Tell us the in tears. the comments. Give me the tears. Everybody looks at me. <laughs> uh, I'm a Greek god. <laughs> you ever seen the one that's really fat? That's the one I embraced. Oh, okay. You gotta find out his name. <laughs> I should. You should get a tattoo of him on your freaking chest or something. <laughs> All right, y'all. Good chest day, good tricep day. Switching up a little bit this week. Tomorrow, we'll see you guys back here <laughs> for back. <laughs> Holla. <laughs>